Hey guys, this is Sean from SeanHunter.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to take a screenshot on your Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge smartphone. There are actually three methods to take the screenshot on your Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge smartphone. So I'm going to show all of these three methods to you. So the very first method to take the screenshot is to press the power key and the home key together at the very same time like this for example i want to take the screenshot of my home screen so i have to press the power key and the volume power key and the home key together at the same time like this and a screenshot is taken if you go to the notification bar here you will find this that the screenshot is captured you can edit share or delete it and if you go to the gallery you will find the screenshot which we have just taken and here it is so you can see that this is an image you can zoom in zoom out you can do whatever you want just like an image if you tap on more and go to the details you can see the resolution of this screenshot is exactly uh, as the same resolution of our Samsung Galaxy A7 Edge screen, that's 1450, 1440 cross 2560 pixels. And this is a PNG file. If you want, you can edit it, the name and everything, or you can edit the picture itself, just like an image. You can just go to the edit section and then you can do whatever you want. You can crop it, you can flip it, horizontal, or whatever you want rotate it it's totally up to you because this is an image so the first method to take the screenshot is you need to press the power key and the home key together at the same time like this and the screenshot will be taken now let's talk about the second method second method is a gesture based method to take the screenshot on your galaxy s7 edge and this option is pre-activated on your device if it is not activated what you need to do first of all go to the settings then scroll down and go to the advanced features option here tap on it and here you will find an option called palm swipe to capture and uh, smart capture so you need to turn on all these these two options to use the gesture based screenshot so for example now if i want to take the screenshot uh, of my settings page so what i need to do i have to put my another hand at uh, the edge of the device either end either on this side on this side you can do from this hand as well and you need to swipe your hand from one direction to another like this and a screenshot will be taken so a screenshot is just taken so if you go to the notification bar you can see the screenshot this is the screenshot which we have just taken this is an image once again so if you go to the gallery you will find this picture is added to the gallery now here which we have just taken off my uh, device settings screen so to take the screenshot on your Samsung Galaxy A7 Edge, this is the second method. You have to activate this feature. This is activated actually by default on every device. If it is somehow uh, deactivated, you need to go to the settings, then advanced uh, features or options, whatever it was, and then just activate it. And then just put your hand at the edge of the screen and move it in one direction and a screenshot will be taken like this so we just took one more screenshot of my home screen and this is the screenshot which we have just taken and there is one more method the third method to take the screenshot is uh, very useful and interesting and it let you take the screenshot of multiple screens or pages for example let's go to the seanheather.com's home page
So this is the shanada.com's homepage. You can see we are having lots of pages and you need to scroll down. You can say it's having multiple page in terms of the browser screen. So if you want to take a screenshot, usually the two methods which I have told you earlier, it was taking the screenshot on this screen only. It was just one single picture. But if you want to take the screenshot of this whole page by scrolling down, how to do this? So you need to go to the settings as I have told you and then go to the advanced feature and you need to activate this smart capture option as I have already told you, you need to activate these two options smart capture and palm sweep to capture and for the third option we are going to use the smart capture feature so let's go back let's go to the browser and here is the shanother.com's homepage and now we are going to take a screenshot of the whole page so first of all just take a screenshot using any first two method i have told you either using the combination of power key and the home key or by swiping your hand from the edge of the screen so for example i'm going to use the first method a screenshot is taken and you will find one option showing here capture more at the bottom of the screen when I'm taking a screenshot. So let me do it once again. Here is the option capture mode, tap on it. Now it will scroll once again, capture mode. And keep using this option capture mode until the whole page is not covered. You can see it's showing screenshot captured and keep showing me more option and also how much screenshot is captured, it's showing at the side of the screen so now the screenshot is taken we didn't capture it for the whole page but here is the screenshot you can see it captured lots of pages uh, from the browser by scrolling down and down and down so this is the third method to capture the screenshot on your samsung galaxy s7 edge so the first one is to use the combination of power key and the home key the second is swapping your hand from one side to another and the third method is an extension of the first two methods by using the smart capture feature and then keep going down and down and capture more of the screen so these are the three methods which you can use on your samsung galaxy 7 s to take the screenshot so thanks for watching the video friends and do not forget to subscribe the channel for more videos tips and tricks and handsome videos like this have a nice day.